So, our topic for today is all about sets. No? So, our objectives for this video. First, we will define what is the sets. No? And then, we will distinguish what is the set and well-defined set. No? Ano yung pagkakaiba na sa, sa sets sa well-defined sets. And then, objective number three is you will write no you will write the this the you will write the set the sets in descriptive form and then uh listing form or roster and the set builder notation no and then last is you will list all the subsets of a set so tara muna natin Let's go to the definition of a set. No? So, in a set, uh, consider the following features. So, the feature number one is a group of frontliners no? in our in different barangays. No? It's the bundle, no? the bundle of face masks in a store. No? Third is a pack of relief goods. And fourth is a group of a large animals. No, so from these pictures, we can define what is the set is. No, so the set is any group or collection of objects, people, or places. The members of a given set are called the elements. No, so so eto sila mga group collection sila yung mga sets pero meron sa, sa bawat sets no meron tayong tinatawag na elements no so set is well defined no i-define natin ang set if it can be determined whether a given element belongs to the set or not no so for example ang set no uh, sabi dito pag well defined yung set pag sinabi natin what are the colors no set yun, no? Colors. What are the colors of the Philippine flag? Ano, ano ba yung mga kulay ng Philippine flag? Ano, mga kulay sa bandila, no? sa watawat ng Pilipinas. So, meron tayong blue, red, yellow, and white. No? Yan, is a set, is well-defined. Well-defined siya kasi they share a common characteristics yung bawat element. The blue is an element, no? The red is an element of the set. Anong set yun? Yun yung set ng kulay sa ating watawat. So, well defined siya, no? Kasi, common characteristics. Lahat ng element na nasa loob nito is colors. And then, no more answer, no? Wala nang iba pang sagot except for this four colors ng ating watawat ng Pilipinas. So, yan yung sinasabi natin. Uh, set is well defined. No? Okay. So, punta tayo sa uh, different kinds of writing the set. Let's go to the uh, notation and the description. No? So, what is the notation and description ng sets? So, we can list sets in three different ways. The number one is the roster no notation or the listing method in this method you will just list all the elements of a set so each distinct element is listed once so ibig sabihin isang beses mo lang siya pwedeng lista kung included lang siya doon no isa lang siya and the order of the element does not matter so let's have an example so set b Okay, dito. Set B is consists of first five letters of the English alphabet. So, ang set daw na B, paano natin sinusulat yung set, no? Eh, B, capital letter, no? B equals the braces, yung opening niya, and sa dulo naman, yung, uh, sa dulo naman, eh, close yung braces, no? Yung brace. Pang-close yung brace, no? So, listing or roster notation no so ililist niya once lang no sabi, sabi, sabi natin sa example dito no the set b consists of first five letters of the english alphabet and ano ba yung mga first five letters ng english alphabet so yan yung a b c 
D, and E. No? So, wala ang magkakaparehas dito. No? Once lang nasulat. A, E, isa lang siya dito sa ating sa ating uh, set. No? And then, kapag pinagpalit ko ba si B tsaka si A na una, no? nagbago ba ako ng set? May gumawa ba ako ng bagong set? Hindi. No? Siya ay set pa rin. Siya pa rin yung set B na tinatawag kahit magbago-bago ang order. So, ibig sabihin nga nito, the order of the element does not matter. So, yan yung example natin. Yan yung listing. No? Roster notation. No? Roster. So, example number 2. No? Sa set X consists of all colors of the rainbow. So, ano-ano ba yung mga kulay ng rainbow? Andiyan dyan, no? So, andiyan yung red, yung orange, yung yellow, yung green, yung blue, yung indigo, yan yung violet, no? Kahit magbago ba, kahit magbago ka pa ng, may, ng pwesto, no? Hindi mo mababago yung set na to, ang set X na to, hindi mo siya mababago because order does not matter kahit anong mauna dyan. So, number two na ating uh, ways of writing the, net, the set is first is the uh, the verbal description method. Sabi dito sa verbal description method, it is a method of describing a set in words. So, is i-describe na lang yung words, uh, yung set in words. So, let's have an example. So, sa set M, no, andyan yung apple, mango, grapes, banana, and watermelon. So, paano mo siya i-describe? I-describe ko lang siya, no, verbally. So, isusulat natin siya. These are, this is the set of, the set M is the set of different fruits. Yun lang, no? So, yun lang susulat mo. The set M is the set of different fruits. So, nasulat mo siya in words or in verbal, no? And then, letter B, no? Example, letter B is the set G equals 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then may tatlong tulad doon, ibig sabihin yan is continuous, no? Uh, infinite ng set. No? Tuloy-tuloy lang. Hindi yan nagtatapos sa 5. So, ano to? Paano natin i-describe ng set na to? So, the set G is the set of all counting numbers. Sila yung mga counting numbers. So, 1, 2, 3, hanggang sa susunod pa. Pataas pa, no? So, yan yung pangalawa. Yung pangatlo naman natin is the last the number 3 no the set builder notation according to the definition of set builder notation no it is a method that lists the rules may rules na tayo rito no that determine whether an object is an element of the set rather than the actual element so bibigay tayo ng example no so write each given set in a in a set builder notation so makikita natin dito yung set j may equal siya, then brace, M, A, T, H, E, I, C, tsaka S. And then, ikakulose natin, no? So, pag set build notation, may rules ka na rito, no? Parang may certain rules ka na ang gagawin dito. So, mayroon na tayong rules dito, no? So, J equals, tas yung brace ang gagawin natin, no? So, ibig sabihin nito, the set of all X such that X is a letter in the word of mathematics. Ano? So, parang rules na to. Lahat na may kita nyo dito na letter sa kanya. No? Ang, ang pag-set build rotation natin dyan is a rule. No? So, X, no? set J is X, set X such that X is a letter in the word, no? letters in the word of mathematics. So, ang vertical natin dyan, na bar, no, translated dyan as such that. Pagbasa dyan is such that. No? Let's have another example. No? So, uh, G A no, equals the uh, raise 0, 2, 4, 6, and 8, then close. No? So, ibig sabihin yan, no, this is the set A is a set of all x such that the x such that x is an even number less than 10. So, sila yung mga even number na less than 10. So, para kang nagbigay ng rules. Ganyan yung pag-build o pag-susulat ng set in a set 
builder notation. 